how does culture become a become a risk? Is that when culture is created separately and out of alignment with the strategy? Is that, is that what you mean? Yeah, I think there's two ways of looking at culture. Every organization has a culture, whether they create it purposely or if it's by default. So default cultures tend to go to the lowest common denominator. I think that's part of the human experience. Uh, that's why it takes good leadership to create a strong, powerful, sustainable culture. When you have a culture that does not enable or support your strategic objectives. So in many ways, that can get in the way, slow down, cause people to behave in ways that aren't aligned with your strategy. So for example, if you have a customer satisfaction strategy, that's where you're really placing your bets. And yet you have very rigid policies about how how much discretion employees have to satisfy the customer, you've probably got a cultural risk there. The other one is if you don't keep evolving and updating your culture, because the world is changing rapidly. Technology is probably the biggest driver, but so is globalization. We're no longer isolated as individuals or companies, and we need to have a culture that really embraces what's happening in the world. And if you don't update and talk about that and refresh and realign your culture, it can become a risk.